29th of July 2009 marked a milestone in aviation and Qantas's history as one of the world's leading long-haul airlines. The very first Qantas 707 arrived in Sydney from Boeing in Seattle on the 2nd of July 1959. At the time, few could have predicted it would become the most important aircraft of its day. It carried almost twice as many passengers and at almost twice the speed of its predecessor, the Constellation. On July 29, 1959, Australia's first jet airliner was ready for its inaugural flight from Sydney to San Francisco. With their jet training completed, the 14 crew members stand ready to play their parts in the occasion. Fifty years ago, the airline's first Boeing 707, the city of Canberra, departed Sydney for San Francisco via Nandi and Honolulu. This dispatch of our first Boeing 707 jet service to San Francisco is the last of quite a long series of such happenings as new services have been opened and new types put on by Quanda. The long-range jet would soon revolutionise air travel shrinking travel times and opening up new routes and opportunities for adventure. Most importantly, the 707's arrival would bring Australia closer than ever before to the rest of the world. Thanks to the international dateline, passengers travelling to Honolulu arrive before they leave, 8.50 a.m. the same day. The 707's speed was matched by its ability to fly at higher altitudes. Cruising at about 10,000 meters, compared with the 6,000 meters of the Constellation, the 707 literally flew above the clouds. Qantas was the first airline to operate the 707 jet outside of the USA, and the first to cross the Pacific. Flight time for the Qantas 707 is 15 hours, 15 minutes. Qantas B-707 jets pioneered new standards of passenger comfort in both first and tourist class. A who's who of Hollywood legends, entertainers and pop stars, prime ministers and politicians would travel on the Qantas 707 jet. And as airfares became more affordable, air travel would no longer be limited to the rich and famous, and tourist class travel would begin to dominate. The jet age had truly arrived, and jet setting would become a catchphrase of the era. On July 29, 1959, another important chapter had been written in the Qantas story, and a new book was beginning. Today, Qantas continues to pursue excellence through its next generation aircraft. Through innovation and customer service excellence, new levels of passenger comfort and an enviable reputation for the highest standards of safety, service and reliability. Qantas is proud to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the jet age coming to the Pacific.